Yo! Oh! What's up, you guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, we are playing Poppy Playtime Chapter 3 once again. So here we are inside of Play Care. We just took this, like, lift thing. And it brought us into the amazing Play Care location. So I guess that this is where all the children used to hang out. They would go to school. They would have fun and play and all sorts of things. And... We just got a call from Ollie letting us know that if we go down the stairs below the statue, we can turn the power onto this whole place. So I'm assuming that the children are maybe that that's what the smiling critters are. They're the children in mascot outfits. So is this where we need to go? Hoppy Hopscotch. Unafraid to hop where others might sit. Hoppy is the friend everyone needs to maintain their energy and enthusiasm. While sometimes loud or impatient, she'll always hop beside her friends, even if it means slowing up once in a while to keep their pace. Yeah, let's hop to the moon. So that's all she says. That is so cool. Hoppy Hopscotch. All right. Oh, maybe this? What is this? Oh, no. Oh, it's a key. Wait. That seemed too easy. So, you got the key. Now the question you're probably asking yourself is, where does it go? Well, head back out, and you should find a door just to the left of the cable car you took down here. Okay, to the left of the cable car. That's how we got here. Let's try this way. A door. Okay, I see it. It's very hidden. Whoa, look at this. Let's try to turn all the lights on. They're having a little tea party over here. Okay, hey, I kind of like Play Care, even though it's probably very, very scary, especially when the lights completely go out. Cat B? Watch your step. Oh, I'm watching. Whoa, Welcome dude. Welcome to the gas production zone, the beating heart of the whole evil Play Care system. All that gas you see coming it's called the red smoke. The red right smoke. Now, it's all headed off to the right. We need to make that red smoke go left instead. That's how we can get to him. The machine will probably have a few dumb safeguards for you to work around, but I think you can do it. I'll call you once it's done. Okay, so we have to make the red smoke go to the left? Does that mean the left tube? Look at this big button. Yeah, we got no power. So it looks like the power needs to go... Oh, batteries. Okay, we have blue battery. Green battery for the door. Let's try in here. Look at the little cat nap. Okay. I, I think this one's broken. Yeah, I don't like the sounds of that. <laughs> what is this? I don't think we can pull on that. Whoa, what is this thing, bro? This place is crazy! It's too big and scary in here. I'm just looking for a battery. Gotcha! So this probably goes into the green slot. And then we're gonna have to find a blue battery. Hopefully that's all we need. But I think that the green one is just for this door. Right here. Another tape player. Right here. We got a tape. Let's go. What is this? Oh, it's a purple arm. <gasps> Press two or scroll. We can change our hands. What does purple hand do? This is new. We've only had the green one before, but now we have purple. Let's go. Okay, let's put the tape in. Maybe it'll tell us something about the new hand that we just got. Yep. Grab pack 2.0. Extended wire length. Okay, that's a plus, so it should be able to go farther. Swapping hands is easy. Yep, you can just scroll. So we go green, purple. This prototype has air jets. To break long falls. Oh, so that we don't take fall damage and break our ankles. But watch where you land. Yeah, you don't want to land in spikes. Not all the ground is safe to touch. Thank you. Grab pack 
What is it? Oh, whoa, dude! We got jump pads! So cool. All right, let's keep looking for that battery. I think we need to find a blue battery. Got another jump pad right there. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Whoa! Yo, I'm having so much fun. Oh, don't fall in there. Yeah, that would, uh, that, that would kill us. <laughs> so we'll pull this like that. Ooh, this seems, it, it seems easy, but like not easy, if that makes sense. I feel like the last chapter was a lot harder. How am I going to get up there? Right when I say something's easy, it gets tricky. I can lower it. No way, dude. Let's try lowering it some more. Yes! Dude, that is so cool. Okay, um, do I have to maybe mm, try to move it a little bit, though? No, I think we just need to jump on it. All right, here goes nothing. Yeah, oh, that's not gonna work. Let's go here. Okay. And I died right at the end. So we have to jump, land on here, move it a little bit, and then we jump again. Easy. Okay, and boom. That is so cool. I love the jump pad. Where do I have to go from here? Hello? Huh. Oh, I have to jump over it. They're making me use this jump pad like crazy. Yeah, there we go. We're going to sneak across. Just like that. We got to jump. Oh, guys, we have another puzzle to do. That was just like that last one we did. Okay, so I know how it works, but I kind of was just guessing. And it looks like we have two of them to try to figure out. How are we going to... Oh, there's a hole. Guys, there's a hole on top of the thing. There's a hole on the thingy right here. Okay, so if I can remember correctly, we have to get power and then I think I figured it out. Well, not entirely, but I know kind of what we have to do. So we get power with one hand, right? We also have to get power to that part of the power thingy. So it's already powered up. That should stay the same. But I have to, like, make it hit that at the same time. So if we turn it, let's try it like that. Okay, that one didn't work. Let's rotate it. I think it's this one. This one has to be angled to touch that yellow hand. Let's grab power and like that. Yeah, that should do it. There we go. I actually really like that puzzle that we're doing. It's, it's really like easy once you figure it out, if that makes sense. <laughs> Nice. Open up the door. Okay, so that is all powered up. As you can see, we have power to these wires. Now we just need to get power to those wires. But we also need to get a battery. Okay, so this is still not powered up. But this is. So do we just press the button now? Yes. I think we have power. Whoa. That should fill up the middle with the red smoke. But if you remember what Ollie was saying, we need power on the left side. Oh no. Oh no! Someone killed the power. Okay. Yeah, it was you! I sent you another key. It's under the statue. Use it to get into home sweet home. Then once you're inside, find the building's backup generator. Good luck! So we have a key that's under the statue that we found the first key and then we have to go to home sweet home maybe there's like a map directory here there is it's literally right here okay so we need to find home sweet home it's going to be that building so we are right here we need to go forward and left home sweet home is up this way with the lights wait why are the lights on in here i thought we had no power it looks a little more friendly than the, the last place we were trying to go to. 
Oh, man, it's like a haunted house, bro. There's not even any rooms. It just opens up to a... a downstairs. Oh, my gosh, bro. I told you I don't got a gas mask. How am I supposed to walk in there with all that red smoke? I think I'm supposed to grab a gas mask. That would probably make a lot of sense, but let's just walk through and see what happens. Oh, we're falling asleep. Into a deep sleep. Let's try to be fast. All we're doing is looking for a backup generator. These are some super steep steps. And a very long hallway. This is crazy. Where is that coming from? This place is so big. Hello? You need to run. Oh, oh, bruh. I am so scared, guys. Like, I was not ready for that. I'm pretty sure that that was catnap. Ollie said we need to run. I have goosebumps, bro. Ollie, you need to call the phone right now and explain why you told me to come here. How many hallways are there? Is this an elevator? It's just a room. Happy and fun. Why was it done? Let's try to watch another tape, maybe. I don't have one. Oh, I just realized that I also don't have my grab pack. I must have dropped it when I got so scared before. Pick this up. And watch it. It's Huggy! Greetings, employees, and welcome to your first day here in Playtime. We're certain that in the days to come, you'll find your new family here every bit as loving and supportive as your own. Feel free to wander the halls, sit in the mess for lunch, or watch our children play and learn to their little hearts' content. Join the innovationists where the bounds of science are continuously pushed. Or join the counselors of Playcare, whose diligence and care for our children will help shape a brighter future. Just you see. Now, every one of you has your part in that future, so should you come back tomorrow feeling unhappy for where you are, or what you've done, worry not, for your supervisor is here and happy to listen. And, should you come back years later, your conscience finally getting the better of you. May Look you descend Huggy Huggy. into the dark and the dust, finding all that awaits you are incomprehensible horrors, each hungry for your return, each eager that they might find you. Perhaps they'd smile at you from a shadow, their smiling mouths full of teeth and meat and plastic. Watching and waiting patiently for their turn at a warm welcome. Or perhaps they won't allow you such time to figure your place in the world you'd left. A world that's theirs now. Welcome home. Yo! Oh! 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 Huggy Wuggy literally came out of the TV! Oh my gosh, my man's is huge! Oh, guys, we're dead. Oh! Huggy, please. I, I, I'm i sorry for what happened at the end of chapter one. It wasn't my fault. Oh! That was crazy. So that was supposed to happen. And we have a grab pack back. I'm just looking for a generator. Oh my gosh. Okay, so, wait, where are we? Are we still in home sweet home? I'm not trying to go through any more creepy hallways. Let's talk to mommy long legs. That is broken. How about daddy long legs? That is also broken. Okay, that is a closed door that won't open and this one seems to also be closed. So we have to get these doors open and turn this power on. This looks a little trickier than before because now we don't have any lights. 
There's nothing for us to interact with up here, but there is this hole. My guess is we need to jump down there. We got our gas mask. Yo, guys, we got the gas mask. So it, it is in the game for us to equip. We're definitely going to need that. So what I'm thinking is what happened right before we ended up where we are now. I'm guessing that that whole Huggy Wuggy situation was a nightmare. Because obviously something can't actually come out of the TV like that. So maybe we actually had a nightmare from walking through the red smoke without this gas mask. That's my theory on that. But hey, we got the gas mask. So hopefully no more nightmares of walking through long hallways and getting eaten alive by Huggy Wuggy. What is this? Wait a second. Does this... I'm thinking that this has to crash through those boxes. Wasn't this in the trailer? And there is red smoke. So we're safe. Okay, so are we gonna have to, like, ride this? Oh, it's like a wind-up toy. And we send it through the boxes. Okay, let's put our gas mask on. And see where this takes us. That gas mask is so cool. Uh, yeah, the car doesn't work anymore. I think I broke it. It's definitely broken, but... What did that just lead us to? Can we actually go up here? Maybe we can crawl? No, there's like no room. What was the point of that? There's gotta be something in here for us to grab. Because why else would we have to... Oh, there's a jump pad. Wait, do we have to... No way. Do we have to jump our way up here? Because that does not work. Oh, we have to go up. So we got to go up and out. Like that. Okay, we're in like an attic or something. Maybe I can take the gas mask off. Because it's kind of hard to see. Whoa, so this is just another room? How do we... Oh, down here. No, I don't want to see that monster. I'm pretty sure it was Huggy Wuggy. It is so dark! A battery. Okay, we got two batteries needed. 0% power. Yeah, that has no power, of course. We have to figure out how to turn... Do, do I just put the batteries in to turn the power on? We have to find another battery. We can go up. But I don't have a jump pad. I don't think we can actually go up there. We gotta go through here. Okay, another door. With a bunch of st- Oh my gosh, that's what I saw! Yo, kissy missy! What are you doing in here? What are you looking at? She's looking at a picture of a child. Could that have been her? Maybe that was her before she became Kissy Missy? She's so concentrated on that picture, you guys. That's definitely either her or like her soul is trapped inside the mascot, I guess. I'm trying to read what that says. I'll zoom in on it. I don't know if it says like friends forever or something. Maybe she was like friends with Oh, look at the scratch on the wall. Dude. So Catnap just probably came in here and terrorized the whole place. That is so creepy. Can I grab onto this? I feel like we need to go up there. Oh, right here. Yeah, we got to go higher. We need to find some more stuff. So we already found one of the batteries. But there's got to be more to this. Look at all the beds in here. What does that say? We have you... We, oh, why have you returned? Oh, no. Why have you returned? This is scary. I think we need to jump down that hole, but I just found a battery. So that'll bring us to this room. So, okay, this is... I can hear Kissy Missy's loud breathing. <laughs> we need to return this battery into, I think, this room? Yeah, right here. There we go, finally. There we go, so that just opened up this. Oh, guys, we're about to go upstairs. 
Where's this gonna lead us to? It says, shh. Catnap is here. We have to be quiet when Catnap gets here. Oh, another car. Let's go. Whoa, that one just hit a big jump. Where did that open up? Oh, it's... Okay, so we're... We're making progress. We have... One of the rooms opened up. That's the main floor that we were at before. But now we have a Picky Piggy statue Hi there. thing. Hi I'm Picky Piggy. Let's eat. Let's eat. I'm Let's Picky Piggy. Eat. Seared elephant? Picky Piggy, Bubba Bubba Fan is an elephant. Why would you want to eat an elephant? Play unicorn. Mm. I keep hearing things. So Picky Piggy, she keeps like mentioning animals that are supposed to be other smiling critters. So hungry. Hey, what do you say you and I be friends? I don't really want to be your friend. Okay, Let's Piggy eat. Piggy, you need to calm down. I think you've had enough. Oh, what do we got in here? Another power source. Okay, so this looks like it's going to be one of the things that we're going to have to turn power on with. But we can't use our hand. We need that to be struck by another power source. Like one of those lasers, I'm guessing. Let's try it. Oh, maybe like this. There we go. Give me that power. I don't want to be locked in here. So what did that just do? Oh, it opened this door. No! Oh, it's temporary. We got to be quick. You got to be quicker than that. There we go. Finally. Get me out of that locked room. Okay, what do we got in here? A bunch of cribs? But what else could be in this mysterious room? There's got to be something else that we need to find. Oh, there's another power source up there. Wait, so we just have to keep... We just got to keep grabbing power. I think what we have to do is just keep turning the power on. But I can move this block a little bit. So we got to, like, jump on these blocks. Grab power. Get more power to open up this door. So we weren't even really supposed to be in that room. There's nothing there. Oh my gosh, that scared me, dude! Okay, is that Bubba Bubba fan? I mean, uh, Bobby Bear Hug? You're not Bubba. Wait. You move. Why are you moving, dude? I thought you were just like a statue. We need to- I- guys, he's got like a battery or something on his back that I saw. But we need him to stop moving. I don't know if I need to take the battery from him. Okay, I guess you're not gonna stop moving and we can't really talk to you. Bobby Bear Hug's still just being creepy. Coming back was a mistake. Oh, let's go through here. This is probably gonna be a mistake as well. Where does this go? Into... Oh, this is the hallway. But is this a new hallway? Oh, another power source. Okay, this is a good sign, guys. We're in a different room. So we have the 50% power. That means that we just have to find two more batteries. Let me go ahead and grab that, because we're probably going to have to open up a door. Can't move that. I found it. Okay, we got it. Power. And then right here, should open up this to another part of the hallway. And then maybe this goes... Wait, he's got the battery. Oh, I see. So how did we get down there? I think we had to take the vent, right? So let's go back through the vent with our battery. And then I think we just need one more battery, and then that will activate the other 50% power. Hopefully. Battery number one. Check. Check. Now we just need to find the second battery. Oh, what is this? Power. 
Wait, what? How do I... Oh. Wait, I have to have two hands of power? Maybe... We go like that. Let's see if this does anything. Power, yes. It worked. But I think we're being timed, so I might have to do that twice. Yeah, I think I have to do it again. I don't know if that's going to turn off. I'm not sure if we're being timed on that. But if we are, that will make a lot of sense. Okay, we are. So I just have to be fast. Do it once. Uh, no. Yes. Okay, hurry up before I lose my power again. I knew it. I was a second too late. Let's try it like that. My hand was picking up the... Trying to, like, grab the, the furnace. There. Wait. No, that turns the power off on that side whenever I use it twice. How do I get that door open? Why is this part so confusing? Okay, so the way that this works is... Wait a second. What if we went like this... Open up the stairwell because there's another power source right there, dude. Wait. Wait. Okay, I think, guys, this shouldn't have been as hard as uh, I was making it seem. Okay, so we have to... We have to open up this right here. And we get our power source like that put that right there and then now this one is the other power source which I think would make sense right okay I figured it out that should not have taken that long but it did oh is that a hand what is that I think it's a plushie hanging from the ceiling it's a bunny Oh, it's catnap upside down. Hey. Catnap. A good day keeps the monsters away. Two hugs a day is better in every way. Hugging forever. Hugs are non-stop. I'm gonna hug you until you pop. Calm down, Huggy Buggy. I don't wanna pop. <laughs> ah. Okay, let's pull this see what it's going to crash into oh right the boxes I love that race car thing it is so cool it just caught on fire oh hi hide uh okay I have a feeling that something scary might happen a little bit because it's been a while but I think now is a time where it might happen. Let's put on our gas mask. Guys, we're going in. Oh. Vent. Maybe this will cut through, like, back to where we need to be. I'm so lost at this point of what we're even trying to do. We, we have to turn the power on. But we, we have to find the last battery. Okay, we have our second battery. Finally. Punch that on. So that should be like everything that Ollie told us to do, right? I thought that it was going to be way easier. Ollie was making it sound like all you got to do is just turn on a button. Press the button. No, it's way more than that. So this is the generator, I guess. Or it's already turned on. And it's saving, so that means that we might die again or we probably have to do something else okay honestly guys i think that this is a good time for us to to end part two because my brain is completely worn out on these puzzles at this point after everything that we just went to so it, as always guys if you are enjoying this and you want to see a part three to poppy playtime chapter three hit that like button because i just went through so much craziness to get to where we are now. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Peace.